Chapter 4 The Sons of Judah, Pharez, Hezron, and Carmi, and Hur and Shobal, and Reiah the son of Shobal, begat Jahath, and Jahath begat Ahumai, and Lahad. These are the families of the Zorathites, and these were the father of Etam, Jezreel, and Ishma, and Idbash, and the name of their sister was Hazel Elponai, and Penuel the father of Gedor, and Ezer the father of Husha. These are the sons of Hur, the firstborn of Ephratah, the father of Bethlehem, and Asher the father of Tekoa had two wives, Hela and Naarah, and Naarah bare him, Ahuzam, and Hefer, and Temanai, and Hayahashtarai, these were the sons of Naarah, and the sons of Hela were, Zereth, and Jezoar, and Ethnon, and Kaz begat Anab, and Zobia, and the families of Aharhel, the son of Haram. And Jabez was more honorable than his brethren, and his mother called his name Jabez, saying, Because I bear him with sorrow. And Jabez called on the God of Israel, saying, O oh, that thou wouldest bless me indeed, and enlarge my coast, and that thine hand might be with me, and that thou wouldest keep me from evil, that it may not grieve me. And God granted him that which he requested. And Kelob, the brother of Shua, begat Mehir, which was the father of Eshton. And Eshton begat Bethrepha and Pasea, and Tehenna ir Nahash, these are the men of Rika, and the sons of Kenaz, Othnael, and Sariah, and the sons of Othnael, Hahath. And Meonothai begat Ophra, and Sariah begat Joab, the father of the valley of Koresham, for they were craftsmen. And the sons of Caleb, the son of Jephunneh, Iru, Elah, and Naam, and the sons of Elah, even Kenaz. And the sons of Jehalaleel, Ziph, and Zipha, Tyraah, and Azareel. And the sons of Ezra were, Jether, and Mered, and Epher, and Jalon. And she bare Miriam, and Shammai, and Ishba, the father of Eshtemoah. And his wife Jehudijah bare Jered, the father of Gedor, and Heber, the father of Soko, and Jekuthiel, the father of Zenoah. And these are the sons of Bithiah, the daughter of Pharaoh, which Mered took. And the sons of his wife, Hodiah, the sister of Naaman, the father of Keilah, the Garmite, and Eshtemoah, the Maacathite. And the sons of Shimon were Ammon, and Renah, Ben-Hanan, and Tylan, and the sons of Ishai were Zoheth, and Ben-Zoheth. The sons of Shelah the son of Judah were Ur the father of Lekah, and Laadah the father of Marisha, and the families of the house of them that wrought fine linen of the house of Ashbia, and Jochem, and the men of Koziba, and Joash, and Saraph, who had the dominion in Moab, and Jeshubaliam and these are ancient kings. These were the potters, and those that dwelt among plants and hedges. There they dwelt with the king for his work. The sons of Simeon were Nimuel and Jamin, Jerob, Zerah, and Sheol, Shalem his son, Mibsam his son, Mishma his son, and the sons of Mishma, Hamuel his son, Zachor his son, Shimei his son, and Shimei had sixteen sons and six daughters. But his brethren had not many children, neither did all their family multiply like the children of Judah. And they dwelt at Beersheba, and Moleda, and Hazar Shuel, and at Bilha, and at Ezem, and at Tolad, and at Bethuel, and at Horma, and at Ziklag, Beth Markaboth, and at Hazar Shusim and at Bethbirii, and at Shearaim. These were their cities unto the reign of David. And their villages were Etam, and Ien, Rimen, and Token, and Ashen, five cities, and all their villages that were round about the same cities unto Baal. These were their habitations and their genealogy. And Meshobab, and Jamlech, and Josah the son of Amaziah, and Joel, and Jehu the son of Josabiah, the son of Sariah,
the son of Aziel, and Elio Eni, and Jacobah, and Jeshohiah, and Asiah, and Adiel, and Jesimiel, and Benaiah, and Ziza, the son of Shiphai, the son of Alan, the son of Jediah, the son of Shemri, the son of Shemaiah. These mentioned by their names were princes in their families, and the house of their fathers increased greatly. And they went to the entrance of Gedor, even unto the east side of the valley, to seek pasture for their flocks. And they found fat pasture and good, and the land was wide and quiet and peaceable, for they of Ham had dwelt there of old. And these written by name came in the days of Hezekiah king of Judah, and smote their tents, and the habitations that were found there, and destroyed them utterly unto this day, and dwelt in their rooms, because there was pasture there for their flocks. And some of them, even the sons of Simeon, five hundred men, went to Mount Seir, having for their captains Pelatiah, and Neariah, and Rephiah, and Uziel the sons of Ishai. And they smote the rest of the Amalekites that were escaped, and dwelt there unto this day.